And I'm here because I had surgery last week, uh, arthroscopic surgery with Dr. Johnson. He repaired my torn meniscus and he's also replaced my knee. I'm ready to go dancing this weekend. You know how they use a scale of one to 10? I was at about a 12, 13, so it was a lot of pain. Uh, I'm at about a two right now. I fell down, um, just I wasn't watching where I was walking and I fell down and I tore the meniscus. And the knee, you know, was just playing basketball and running and all that kind of stuff and not listening to the doctor's advice and stopping running when I was around 40, 45. So that was just a, a total knee replacement. My wife and I went dancing for the first time in about four years, last New Year's Eve, when he replaced my knee. Uh, it was just horrible. It was in pain every single night. And, and I, went, I attended one of his seminars, and uh, you know, I really liked what he said, and I liked the young kid. He's a young whippersnapper, you know. Um, but I really liked what he said, and, and uh, I liked where the patient came first and pain management and all that kind of stuff. And so I finally decided I'm just gonna jump in and get it done. Um, I got the surgery done, it went real well. My left knee now is just totally pain free. Yeah, full range of motion, no pain. I, I guess the best thing about it all is that the pain is gone, uh, which, which meant, you know, taking ibuprofen or Tylenol or something like that to be able to sleep through the night. Uh, and so now, you know, I work out hard and, and, and I'm real tired and I go to sleep. I don't wake up till the following morning. The nurses came in, they attended to me real well. I think I saw the doctor a couple of days later. He came in, checked my knee, they sent me home. Uh, they started with the rehab, uh, you know, I think the next day they started coming in and torturing me, making me bend it at 90 degrees and do this and that and the other. But uh, I will tell you that, uh, that that's probably one of the best things that anybody can do that's had knee surgery is to really follow the post-operative stuff, you know, especially with the physical therapy, because that will bring your range of motion back. As a matter of fact, on my arthroscopic knee today, he wants me to start riding the bicycle probably today to get it back in motion again. Like I tell you, I was real skeptical at first, you know, I'd, he I'd heard some horror stories about some knees that didn't go well and they'd have to go back like three or four times. But what convinced me was when he did the, um, a seminar, I attended a seminar at the Providence and you know, he was just really down to earth. And he, and he said, you know, I understand it's gonna hurt and pain management and the, the patient comes first here. And I really liked that. I really enjoyed what he had to say. And three weeks, a month later, we were on the table. The staff is really good, very hospitable. Carmen is very, very good keeping the appointments, making sure you've got your appointment date. Uh, Robert is a PA, excellent, excellent young man. And then of course, you know, the doctor's just, uh, you know, just, He's just a, a very personable, very likable young man. Um, he's just somebody that once you meet him, you, you, you trust him right away. I would recommend him to anybody and to everybody. If you've got knee pain, if you're having shoulder pain or, or any kind of pain at all that has to do with the joints, I highly recommend you come to him. Uh, not only that, it's, it's just the quality of life improves, you know. Especially as you get older, you young whippersnappers don't understand that because you're still kind of young. But as you get old, your, you know, your range of motion starts to, to deteriorate and you, you can't dance, you can't do the things that you want to do. Uh, I'm, like I tell you, I'm 68 years old and I feel great. 68 and feeling great, thanks to Dr. KJ.